So, okay, let's start by who I am and where I come from. I was born and raised in Mexico City, so the first years of my life, I was landlocked. But my first encounter with surf photography was when I was in college and I was doing my professional practices. I ended up hanging out with a bunch of surfers and I remember I watched the photographers and I just couldn't believe that there was a job where you get paid to follow surfers and travel to the most amazing beaches. They were working on an article for a magazine and I was just amazed by how it worked and, and that life. But it wasn't until after I graduated from college that I got immersed in the surf lifestyle. So I traveled to Hawaii around 2011 and that's where I met surf filmmaker and photographer Peter Sterling who got me under his wing and taught me everything that I needed to know about surf photography. By then I already knew how to swim since I was a swimmer uh, when I was a little girl. I was like a high performance swimmer for almost nine years. So water, I was like natural in the water, but um, I didn't know about oceans, surfing, and all the weather that gets involved for a good shoot and all these things. So I had to learn that from scratch. This mentor was the one that taught me all of that. And I'm super grateful for that because there's so much you need to do besides just knowing how to operate your camera in surf photography. For me, it was like learning from the beginning how the ocean works, how the wave works, how the wind affected, the storms, the sport, because you need to know the sport too. And so, yeah, it was learning everything from the beginning. And I've always had this passion for photography since I was a little girl. I wanted to um, actually study photography, but ended up going for business. Um, but when I, after I graduated, I took photography course and that's how I learned the basics and then everything else has been you know through life and like having mentors or like people and friends that have shared their knowledge with me and I am super super grateful for that because that has helped me become the photographer I am today.